From the air, you can see where the single engine plane landed in the middle of the Quabbin Reservoir. Checking Google Maps, it appears that area would ordinarily be underwater. But with a reservoir this summer at 86% of capacity, the sandbar was large enough to put down the small plane intact. The pilot, a 42-year-old man from Newport, Rhode Island, telling us by phone that he is okay. An experienced pilot with a commercial pilot's license, he was flying his experimental homemade plane, a carbon cub model, from Newport to Vermont to meet his family. Telling state police around 3.50 this afternoon, he experienced engine trouble. The Quabbin is strictly restricted from all aircraft. Still, the pilot putting that plane down on the sandbar and walking away from it unharmed. State police and DCR quickly reaching the scene by boat. Officials say the water on the Quabbin is safe. The plane was left on the sandbar overnight. Removing it, easier said than done, and may require taking it apart piece by piece. And tomorrow, we're told the pilot, state police, the FAA, and the National Sa uh, Transportation Safety Board will be meeting here to check out to see exactly what went wrong and to determine if the pilot will face any fines. Again, the trickiest part, coming up with a plan to get that plane off the sandbar. Live in Belchertown, Jorge Quiroga, WCBB News Center 5.